Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks very much for joining us again today. I've got a very short video demonstration for you today that will show you how to make a pop-up for the Squarespace website. So how to create a little pop-up message that appears on your site when people first navigate to it or when they first open a page or whatever. And uh, just before we do so, I'd like to point your attention at a link in the description for this video which will take you to a free trial version of the Squarespace editor. Okay, so if you want to give all of this a go and make your own website, you can do so by clicking that little link down there. So what you'll need to do is log in to the website backend so that you've got a view of this page here where you can manage all the sort of stuff about the website. And then you'll go to the marketing page. Okay, so just click marketing here in the list is the fourth one down. And then it's got in Squarespace the ability to create a promotional pop up built into here. So if you click that, it then allows you to choose from a range of different things and uh, content to put on your pop-up and asks you what you want to collect in terms of information and things like that. Um, so obviously you can see that it's now added a pop-up to this page and when I scroll up and down it, the pop-up kind of stays centered like that. Um, so obviously, you know, you can kind of... Um, display it like that and obviously it tells you then when a visitor opens up your website that that will appear okay so you can kind of turn it on and off like that you can change the layout of it by single clicking it and um if i just save those changes like that and then you've got all of these presets that you can choose from so if you've got an idea in mind pick a preset that's closest to that idea and then kind of modify it to suit your needs then okay that's kind of standard advice so if I pick that one, for example, and I just hit save, that will then take me back to the promotional pop-up editor. And then from there, I can choose the action that I want to occur as well. Okay, so if I go and, um, you know, it asks you kind of in a quite a logistical way, really, a logical way, what, what you want from the pop-up. You know, do you want them to sign up or do you want them to click a button? So obviously, you know, for this one, we'll keep it as sign up for a newsletter. And then from there, then it asks you if that's the case, you know, what you want in the placeholder text for that text field, what you want the button labeled as. So you can just type that in as text yourself there. And then um, do you want any kind of verification or a recapture or, or whatever as um, a method to stop kind of bots or anything like that from adding themselves to the mailing list? And then if we go back a second, um, the display and the timing of it, so you can kind of dictate your, the behaviors of the pop-up. Um, obviously, it doesn't have to be, you know, a marketing one. I could take that subscribe button off. I could change the message. I could take the text field off. I could kind of, you know, just make it a pop-up message. For example, you know, making people aware of some event or something like that. And then, you know, um, when to display the pop-up is, is here. And you want it after five seconds or showing a timer and you know you've got a couple of options there and then you've got the ability also to set the intervals at which it reoccurs for a visitor so if someone's seen it you know how often do you want them to kind of be presented with it again do you want it every day in a week every fortnight every month or maybe never as well it gives you that option so um, as you can see, it's very customizable and you can kind of make it fit your needs, really. And very handily gives you a live preview of it as you're building it as well. And that concludes our video tutorial. So don't forget as well that, like I mentioned at the beginning, there's a link in the description for this video that will take you to a free trial version of Squarespace if you want to give it a go and make your own pop-up message. If you like this kind of content and you would want to see more tutorials and reviews, give us a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you'd like to see any content with any specific questions or if you've got any problems or anything like that leave them as comments down below thank you very much